Hey guys, welcome to another video. Sorry, I've been away for a little bit, uh, but I got something really cool for you guys today. So uh, I live in Miami, Florida. Just so happens that in Florida, um, the Sin Drive was created. Uh, it was created by Alfonso Hermida. You may know this pedal from Robin Ford. You know, this is one of the first Dumble style pedals and you know, many came afterwards. But I have uh, three original Zen drives for you here. Uh, let me start with the stock one. Um, this belongs to my friend Joe Polovkin. And this is a stock Zen drive, Hermita Audio, he bought from uh, Alfonso right out of his house. You know, before Alfonso blew up. But uh, here we go, stock Zen drive. One thing I want to talk about first is what the knobs do before we go into some playing. So volume, volume, uh, gain, controls the amount of gain. Now tone is a tricky thing because actually the tone functions as a high cut. So um, as you have it all the way out, you basically have all your highs. And as you turn it counterclockwise, you basically cut all the highs. So that's one thing to keep in mind. Uh, I see a lot of demos where people set it at 12 o'clock and that's not really where you want it to be um, for your uh, your stock settings anyway. And then voice uh, kind of, you know, uh, plays a little bit with your amp and your guitar. You'll find that if you, if you turn it counterclockwise, it'll add a little bit of low end. If you turn it clockwise, It'll kind of uh, tighten up the bottom end a little bit and adds a little bit more gain to compensate for the loss of lower end. So, okay, so here's uh, the stock Zen Drive. And then this one also belongs to my friend Joe. This is a Zen Drive 2. Uh, as we can see, it has the same, same controls. This is just a modification of the Zen Drive. And now this one belongs to my friend Kinch O'Kane. Uh, you should check out his YouTube channel. He's got some really cool and funny videos, all music related. But anyway, same story. He bought this off of um, off of Alfonso from his house. This obviously has a lot more use than the other two. But uh, he took it back to him and he asked them to modify it to add more gain. So as you're gonna hear, this has a little bit more a little bit more saturation, perhaps. Um, so here we go. It's a Zen Drive party over here, and uh, let's get into some music. Okay, we're gonna start with the stock Zen Drive. Modern one. Now the Zen Drive Two. Okay, some leaves playing. Okay, let's go ahead and mess with the game a little bit. Okay, let's go ahead and mess with the tone a little bit.
Okay, let's find the middle. Okay, so now we're going to mess with the voice a little bit. Let's go the other way. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to boost the volume and the gain so we get the, the most amount of gain that we can get on this pedal. And I'm going to tone the voice just a little bit uh, down, see where we can find that sweet spot. Let's just try some things for fun over here.
check my tuning room. 